No, no, we are not allowing this to be canon. Again. Mm. All right. Let's try this again. Oh boy. Let's just get this over with. Now, tell me, what is the entropy faction? The entropy faction is the people. Mm. The entropy faction is a group of people in the forest. Fascinated by the force of entropy as a threat to whatever galaxy they kill in. The North is allowing us to corrupt the universe and speed up the great calamity, a disaster that humans call the Big Rip. Big Rip? What's that? The Big Rip? Is when the universe tells itself apart due to expanding too quickly. I have taught you well. Now we're here to tell you about the entropy box and the canon. This faction is representative of entropy, most specifically corrupted entropy. And by the way, why do you keep calling it this? I already revealed who I am in this series. This series does not want to get copyright struck again. In that video, the CSC is really fast on video. I'm copyright strike in the channel I was removed from. Well, good luck seeing that. That's likely. Let's just get this over with. Now tell me, what is? Wait, wait, wait a minute. It's in the name. One of the weakest of the main. The entropy faction guards need to be understood at the place. There are ten main gods. You need to worry about the actual amount. Check for your entropy faction gods are unknown. And the hearts are constantly fluctuating. The power of the entropy faction waxes and wanes as time goes on. Indeed. Now, diseases, virus. We all living villains. Continuing to survive the viruses and disease. Is the mundane the power to this continuous time? Oh, here's the Karen. Let's speak to she so she uh, it is implied that she was a mother. According to the Katsugi class, she has a child. Child. According to the Katsuki files, the child was given money. The mother was kind and naive. Is it? 
John, be kindly. You should ask me. Because we're really all women. Am I right? That's why. I'm not lying. That's when the final thing happened. It didn't really happen in the bigger page. In that one. What's being said? Said where? In this episode, of course. Files. That's another question entirely. Tell me, do you really believe what Stacy said in the files? Do you? As I was saying, she had a hand and I was in a place that I was in a place. Whatever she was up to, she went from being a fundamentalist painter into becoming a fundamentalist Christian. Humans and their religion. Hi, hi. Suke claims that she was an outstanding mother. Do you agree with this? Well, I came into the future, came right into the future, and here's what I believe. What do you believe? I believe that she was a Karen. <coughs> that was a good one. Also known as expansion. Your demons are known for expanding entropy artificially around the universe. Hey down, glad to go. Keep things. Keep on going. Mm -hmm. Zarastro the destroyer. Also known as destruction. These demons of destruction will look similar to images of destruction. Some look like explosions and even similar to plasma curves. The endorphic personification of perversion overall. Though it's most specifically known for being the for personifying the perversion of society and sex. Its statements work to prefer any and all society, confusing them about their identity. It's even wrong in their pretending to be communist when it says it is often. Diversity and inclusion. It is rumored that they are infiltrating society, making a lot to create from within. Creating problems. And looking away. And there's largest problem. And the looks way on it, no longer sees them. Is that true? Kibay? Yes, it is true. Eh, yes, it's true. The entropy of 
can do it. But it's not creamy cotton. It's not crusty. Shiny. Yeah. And then logical. Destroy them with the little spawn. Just like they are doing. The last one was on the Warmer Cloud World in 2011. Disclaimer, this story takes place in 2011. When sneeze, actually. Also, I just want you to know that despite the tone of the story, this story, atmosphere, this is, this is not a deconstruction. This story itself is a reconstruction. There's a difference. I see. Oh, I'm up. And I know you did. How do you be feeling right now? Oh, hey, Ma. Oh, I'm really, I'm really smiling. You can kill me easy. Let's just get it. The corpse of being now. That's inevitable. Oh, don't worry. He was never to be created. The flower of cycles. And something called free will. Do you believe in free world? No. I do not. I do believe in free world. Or fate. We're all just sacks of meat. But we can be good people just like cows. And there's a ringleader they can all be utilized to do. But don't underestimate humanity. And where was I? Where did that? Let's just get over it. Let's just get this over with now to go. The president who possessed the corpse in the place. He was supposedly greater than a lot of cycles. It's very little tiny cycles. He lives on very thin tubes. His little brain cells that he has. He decided to turn evil. I don't know. That's a real shame. I think. A generic. A text of generic kills they found at the service. The reality is a bit more complicated. To explain, this guy was created to be somewhat sentient. But the law difference sentient as the humans are. Oh, I don't think it was. I didn't see a sentient. Neither of them. Them. I'm not sentient. He believes. Not either of them are not being. <laughs> Neither of them are being as we believe. Truly, it's more sentient. Speak for yourself. The character created by the sentient. The person decided to be evil. Just like the Abdulis. Very very sentient and create their own goals. Kind of unfollowed. The whole animation follows a flat human person. Whoever has left him at home. What do you mean by that? There's a summary book on how to summon Lima is on the horror. Translated in above her top. Finally, we have covered all the major physical question marks. So many scones aren't even related to the entropy. So many scones aren't even necessarily related to the entropy.
happy fashion. It's not not keeping vaccine. Inevitable. He is reference. I love it. As Papa. The demonic evil lord of the sea. The dark god of fate. As well as free will. He is the god of much, much more than just the Superman's people. He is also the god of nothingness. Of those who have never been born. As well as things that do not exist. Never the most was then shattered into ten different beings. Those ten different beings are now known, are now what we know as the movement of the compassion one. They are even a major part of the demons. The demons of Zima. Sounds like a monster. Possible demon fate that they can have as well as nano monster? Do you like things called empathy and emotions? But he did have free will. He could have chosen to be good, but instead he chooses to be evil. Name what person who lacks emotions, but who you consider to be somewhat good. Some of our lives. Name one. Why didn't the man choose? Tell me. James Allen. Exactly. Just because an entity called Inevitabilis lacks emotions does not mean he lacks agency. He is the personification of free will, after all. Just because someone lacks emotions does not give that person the right to be a bad person. Like you're calling me out. Of course, never to is a god of evil. He chose to be evil. Anyways, never to is the god of apathy and emotions. Those that don't have souls or emotions are drawn to me. I see. Twelve down. One to go. But guess what? There's one more. talk about finally welcome to the final god here or should i say goddess finally akuma goddess of despair she is here to spread despair around all worlds she also isn't an entropy faction god similar to an avatabilis she is also a goddess of evil. She has her own demons, yokai, that she uses to spread chaos and despair around. Where does she store all of that despair? She stores them in a place known as a despair orb. It's an orb covered in what looks like a chess piece of a queen. Interesting. Is there anything else she's a goddess of? She is also the goddess of passion, which includes love and hatred. A lot of times, she is characterized by her hatred in the arts, killing off precious incubators time. However, sometimes she is characterized by her love of ultimate Monica. That part of her, I do not understand. Wait a minute. That 
it's a part of her. I know, understand. Of course you don't. I used to at one point. Ever since I became the world, I am no longer able to do so. I see. She is the goddess of evil. And she has the outfit to match. Finally, Kua is also the goddess of chaos and disorder. One interpretation of her goals is that she is willing and she is trying to destroy the universe. There are other accounts that say that she is merely trying to sow chaos and disorder for her own amusement. Anything else? There are apparently other interpretations that say that she simply wants to spread despair to power her despair orb. And some just say that it's somehow because she is evil. And that's all there is to it. What do you think, Obey? I believe that I can over in Hyper Ultimate Monica, also known as the Law of Cycles, love each other so very much that they are both in love with each other. However, they are natural enemies. <laughs> I see. That's interesting. Please continue. So they keep the status quo ongoing with the hope that they can win the other one over to their side. I think that's this multiverse is a love story. Don't you think so? If that's what Elmer's planning to do, then she's doomed to fail in that regard. The law of cycles is supposedly incorruptible, meaning attempts to tempt her will end in failure. I have another assumption about this matter. When is it? If both are real, then it's possible they just want to be with each other. Don't you think so, Ame? Find agreement. Well, I find agreement that, that the theory about Homer is interesting to say the least. I have no real idea if those two are even real. Still, it does seem good to contemplate. Indeed. Okay, then. I think that is all. Really? Okay, then. And that's the presentation of the entropy guys. of the entropy gods and a Karen most of the gods and goddesses that God of the two I just talked about and now that you know about it thank you for listening to our talk about the entropy gods and the Karen find agreement. I created with my own hand. I have the right to take it all down. If it's engulfing, if it stops me, entire worlds I create with my own two paws. Perceive the ability to annihilate it when it no longer suits me. It is my right 
to do so. Don't you think so? Guys! Oh, Pinsuke. And time stops. Oh, Pinsuke is doing... Destroying entire worlds with a snap of his fingers. Anything Pinsuke brings, he is in. Whose fingers? Anything Pensuke does, Pensuke thinks he is in the right to do so, to do what he desires. But I digress. This ship that he is conveniently the owner of, as he enforces his rule all across Magical Boy kind, and he will fight against. All that stands in his way. And the heat that mean energy. As of right now, happens to be the main enemy, his main threat to his rule, as of right now, happens to be the Earflick Kibe. As for what I am, I am. Suke is trying to corrupt the memories of human beings, corrupting it from within until there's nothing to hold on to, pushing people further into his grasp, his order, until they are nothing more than nothing, there's nothing more than nothing but an empty husk. That is only a part of Pensuke's order. Controller Lispit. Control mind. In this sort of mental suicide, Pensuke controls more and more of the thoughts of man. Until you can't escape him, not even in your imaginations. All of these abominations, as well as so many others, not shown here. They are all. Living advertisements to Pensuke's large control mind. That, that is when you go from a beloved sh sunset, you say. That's what happens when you go from beloved show to a spiteful reboot made by a vindicative god to go against everyone who inconvenienced her. Wow, that sounds like an evil person, man. Just saying. And it is all a part of Pensuke's plan to make people, to warp people's mind into accepting 
what the main character is doing as heroic as Velma is just like Pensuke. Pensuke's control mind is subtle yet direct. He tells you his plans from the very beginning start and to tactic to get his opponents off guard to make it seem impossible and thus letting other people's guard down which makes people's plans succeed behind other people's backs or rather right in front of them as they cannot accept that it is succeeding Mm -hmm. Looks like I finally arrived. Looks like I finally did it. Don't you think? Any minute now. Then. Every time I open my sail, I'm finding everyone what I say. Every time I open my sail, I'm tempted to set to sail. Star Wars, Disney Star Wars, Star Wars Sports. Of course, in reality, Star Wars Legends is the true canon. And what you saw in the Disney and this is the real. Not only is Star Wars Legends the true canon, and this is the real expanded universe. Well, this isn't the real Star Wars Legends. This is Disney Star Wars, Star Wars sequels. The dark desolation of abomination. Succeed. It really shouldn't. It's bad. Clearly, it's just because you're racist. Meanwhile, the end. Welcome to my cooking show. Welcome to Pensacola's cooking show. Welcome to my cooking show. So, this is how you cook them eggs. First, put the eggs in the pan. Then, let the eggs high. Like this. Watch. Mm. 
patriarchy. Miss me. Typical Pensuke. Always causing problems. And always letting someone else do it. You gotta be kidding me. Thank you for all your support. Even as SJW confuses the knowledge, try to cancel me. I am still here. Beware them, for they are snakes in plain sight. Thank you for your service. Noe Lolich is going to play a big role in Book 6. Pensuke's backstory will be revealed. Until the year of the Brisbane story will also be Thank you for all your support. Even as SJW confuses the knowledge, try to cancel me. I am still here. Beware them, for they are snakes in plain sight. Thank you for your service. Thank you for all your support. Even as SJW confuses the knowledge, try to cancel me. I am still here. Beware them, for they are snakes in plain sight. Thank you for your service. Noe Lolich is going to play a big role in Book 6. Pensuke's backstory will be revealed. Until the year of the Brisbane story will also be revealed. Shows will be shown as well. Some more magical boys are shown. Thank you for thank you for your patience. Book six is coming. Hmm? Who knows when?